But watch in this area of low pressure, you can see the rain with it. And there are a couple different batches. There's one here, one here that's going to have kind of a tough time working its way to the east. And then more develops along that cool front to the south and east. Remember, I'm still watching some of these local rivers like the Wolf, the Fox. They're still up there. So we just saw a story about that before. And with more rain on the way, again, it doesn't take much to cause a couple concerns with those rivers. But right now in Green Bay, it's still dry out. 51 degrees, it's not that cool. But winds coming off the lake today, definitely going to keep it cooler there. Not as warm any of us as yesterday. So here's that first batch of rain and a couple rumbles of thunder. The second one way off to the south. Now let's get a little bit closer here as we head towards Marquette County, Green Lake. Some showers developing, a couple rumbles of thunder working their way through uh, Washera County as well. Now I'm not getting a lot of reports by Oshkosh and Appleton of any significant rain yet, but it's very close. It's just knocking on your door. Here's Green Bay. It's just off to the west. Well, package probably raining by you right now. Skycast showing this trying to work its way to the east. Maybe this first batch not going to be doing as good a job, but here comes the second batch as we head towards the noon hour. Maybe a break and more scattered showers and thunderstorms into the evening. Those taper off before midnight. Now our temperatures today 64 the average high. We're going to be closer to that today. No 80s for you today. Yesterday, 82 degrees, of course. There's some of that cooler air. International Falls 66. That's for us today and even cooler by the lake. Current temperatures, speaking of cooler by the lake, there's Kiwani 44. We got 54 in Appleton, 62 in Oshkosh. So wide range of temperatures. Either way, it's not going to be as warm as yesterday. So here's that first batch and then the second batch rolling its way on through. And then more shower and thunderstorm development heading through the afternoon into the evening. I'm not saying it's going to rain all day. There will be breaks. And speaking of a break, there's tomorrow. Tomorrow should be a pretty decent day. Friday, though, I'll get to that in a second. So the rain forecast here, you see some of these blues, that's over a half inch in spots, maybe a couple locally higher amounts under any shower or thunderstorm as well. 66 today, cooler by the lake, areas of rain or a thunderstorm. Again, not an all day thing. There will be a couple breaks for tonight. If there's a shower storm out there, that's going to come to an end as the evening goes on. For tomorrow, a break for a day. 64 looks like more rain develops for us for Friday. Look at that. Yikes 48. Oh, now Saturday though, Brooke, it's looking like the stationary front going to set up maybe a little bit farther to our south. So now it's just a chance of rain. OK, so maybe it wouldn't uh, last all day if you'd see it on Saturday and Sunday looking a lot better. So weekend not a wash. No, 